In today's tutorial, I'll show you how to make a custom money GUI that is linked up to your leader stats and will go up as your leader stats value goes up. Without further ado, let's get right into this video. Let's start off by pressing our server script service and inserting, inserting a script. Rename this to leader stats, leader stats if you don't already have a leader stats script. Copy and paste this in from the description. This should be your leader stats. There's also some helpful um, notes that will tell you exactly what to do if you're a bit clueless with this script. Okay, close that tab, and we can also press this arrow to close up that. Next we can do is we can press on star GUI, insert a star GUI, rename this to money GUI, money GUI, whoops, I spell money GUI, money GUI, and then after that, we can go ahead, add in a text label. Place this text label wherever you want. I'm going to place it right here. And press text scaled. And I'm going to use source sans bold, bold, bold. And use left. And then right here, I'm just going to go money. Okay. Now that we have this done, I'm going to change, I'm going to change up the color of the t font a bit. Maybe make it a bright green with a bit of a darker green outline and set the tech nope set the background transparency up here where is it to be one and let's find the text transpare okay um let's set the text stroke nope where is it text stroke ah and then text size okay i think that this should be just about fine for us Okay, now you have this nice little money thing. What I recommend doing is just scale this up as far as you can go. This will be very useful in case the, um, the money number gets really long. Okay, what we can do from here is insert a local script. And we're going to go and press local, or not, we're going to type local player is going to be equal to game.players.local player. And then right here, let's do local leader stats is equal to player colon wait for child and then leader stats leader stats and then what we can do is we can go local money or yeah local money ah I can't spell money is going to be equal to leader stats colon wait for child and we're going to wait for money okay now what we can do is let's go money colon we're gonna get a property change signal so this is gonna fire every time the property is changed and we're gonna go and get the property which is value because that's the because that's the property that we're trying to check if it's changed and then when it's changed we're just gonna go colon connect function and then press the enter key let's just quickly do local label local label is gonna be equal to script dot parent and then right here we can do is label dot text is equal to um, money on money dot value okay we also want to do is we also want to copy and paste this and paste it just a bit higher the reason we have to do this is because when the player joins in the since the value hasn't actually changed at all so it just won't so it just won't show anything well, actually, this will okay to make this a little bit better. Let's put these two quotation marks at the beginning, and simply um, type in money colon space and then dot dot. This will give us our this will show us money. You'll see what I mean. Okay, now if we were to um, press play, we should see let's play. You should see that our money is zero, just like our money up here is zero. Although, if I were to change this value to be um, 14, let's do 14. If I were to join in, it will display 14. And if you were to click something that adds money, you'll see that this value constantly goes up. Hopefully this tutorial helped you. Make sure to subscribe. I really want to reach 25 subscribers soon. Anyways, hopefully you enjoyed, and see you. Have a nice day.